Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Before we start, please subscribe our channel. Today, we will be discussing with you, 12 Apple Car Play Tips Every Driver Should Know. Number 1, Focus on Your Driving. With iOS 15, Apple revamps the iPhone's Do Not Disturb option into a new mode called Focus, which can help control notifications. To allow notifications from certain contacts, tap the People section under Allowed Notifications. Here, you can add or remove specific people and set whose calls can go through. Under the Options section, you can set up automated messages to alert anyone who tries contacting you that you're currently driving. Tap the entry under Turn On automatically to determine when this focus should be used. Number 2. Multitask while using CarPlay. In the past, CarPlay would simply mirror whatever app was open on your phone, but that wasn't always helpful when trying to do two things at once. For example, if you had maps open on your car's dashboard and someone opened the music app on your phone, you would lose your directions. With iOS 13 or higher, that won't happen. Your passenger can open any app on your phone, and the dashboard view remains the same. Number 3. Control your dashboard. Up until iOS 13, your dashboard could display only one app at a time. If you wanted to see the map's navigation screen and use your music player, you would have to bounce back and forth between the two. Now you can split the screen between two or three apps to queue up driving directions in one window, control music from another, and view your calendar in a third portion of the screen, for example. The dashboard also has three different configurations you can switch between by tapping the home button. Display your current or last app in full screen, view several apps in split screen mode, or view the home screen with access to all your apps. Number 4. Customize your wallpaper. Each new version of iOS adds more wallpaper images to paint your CarPlay background. To customize your wallpaper, open the Settings app in CarPlay and select Wallpaper. Tap the image you want to use as your new wallpaper, and then tap the Set button. Number 5. Stay hands-free with Siri. If you need to communicate with others while driving, Siri can come to the rescue and offer hands-free messaging options. You could say something like, Hey Siri, send an audio message to person's name, then record your message. You can then review or change the message before sending it. Siri will also share your ETA with someone else, a helpful addition if you're running late to an appointment. Just say, Hey Siri, share my ETA with person's name. Number 6. Find an EV charging station. If you own an electric vehicle, you can get help from CarPlay when it's time for a charge. Press the search bar in Apple Maps and type in EV chargers. Tap the EV chargers entry from the search results to see a map with the nearest charging stations. Number 7. Add more apps. Apple has expanded the types of apps it supports through CarPlay. You can add compatible apps for EV charging stations, parking, food delivery, and other categories. You can also turn to alternative navigation apps like Google Maps and Waze. Number 8. View detailed maps. Most drivers use CarPlay for driving directions, so Apple has beefed up its Maps app to deliver more information. While navigating a route, you can see the speed limit, direction, estimated arrival time, 3D buildings, and businesses like gas stations and restaurants. Siri also gives more specific driving directions these days, such as turn right at the next traffic light instead of turn right in 800 feet. Number 9. Listen to the Music App With iOS 13 or higher, the Music App is easier on the eyes when using CarPlay. Album art is large, so you can more readily identify an album visually. Navigating to your albums and playlists is a quicker and simpler process. The interface is more intuitive as you can see your album art on the right side of the screen and still use the touchscreen controls for playing music. Number 10. See what's playing. 
you can easily see full details on whatever song, podcast, or audiobook is currently playing via an app called Now Playing. The Now Playing app can be accessed from the home screen, or if you're already in an audio app, just tap the audio graph icon in the upper right corner. Number 11. View your calendar. You can view your calendar appointments for the current day. Just navigate to the home screen and tap the calendar icon or ask Siri to show you your calendar. Number 12. Tweak CarPlay Settings. CarPlay offers its own dedicated settings app through which you can tweak different options, enable or disable driving focus, Siri suggestions, and album art. There's also a switch that sets the CarPlay app's color scheme between dark mode and the default light theme. They are really amazing. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to like, share and subscribe.